Thinking of studying in Germany, but you don't know which course to choose. With tuition-free education and world-class program, Germany has become a global magnet for students. But choosing the right course can make or break your career abroad. As someone who has lived, studied and worked in Germany for over six years, I'm going to break down the best and most future-proof courses to study in Germany as an international student in 2025. Stick around to the end because I will share a bonus tip that could save you from making the number one mistake that most international students make when selecting a degree. Let's dive in. Now, before we go into the video let's talk about why selecting the right course is very very important now as we all know in germany studying in germany is a very very low risk because the cost is quite low but if you choose the wrong course to study then the risk becomes exponentially high and i will explain more in this video now what you need to understand is the job market in germany is skill specific which means that if the skill you are picking or the course you are studying is not relevant to the german market they have no mercy on you it doesn't matter how many years you study that, that course they don't give a flying them if the course is not relevant or if the skill that you have is already obsolete it's no longer in demand they don't care that's the honest truth the market will punish you for not knowing and that's just the truth so it's very very imperative that you understand the current market landscape in germany and the courses that are relevant so if you are coming to germany to just wing it and just pick anything and just hope for the best then you are shooting yourself in the feet you are going to struggle a lot so this is why it's very very important that you understand the course you are picking why is the course relevant in the german market if it's not relevant please don't bother yourself and don't come here with the mindset of i'm just going to pick any course and when i get there i'm just going to figure it out you will not figure shit out you will struggle a lot pay attention to the tips i'm giving in this video the first on my list is robotics and ai now now, unless you are living at the rock you know that the whole world is becoming more ai centric and more robotic centric if they say word like that but you get what i'm trying to say now you can see what will take you maybe 20 minutes or maybe one hour to figure out ChatGPT will do it for you in five seconds. ChatGPT has made life so easy for so many people to the point where they've even banned it from some countries. Especially if you are studying, you cannot use ChatGPT to research or do anything anymore. That's how effective this has become. But so many people are relying on AI now because it makes your work easy, more efficient, you know. And of course, more and more jobs are going to be replaced by AI that's the honest truth if you can tap into this if you can learn anything ai related or robotics trust me you're going to be a hot cake and the funny thing is in germany right now so many people are not even on this bandwagon yet so many people are not really studying courses in this field so if you have an opportunity or if you have knowledge about ai or you know how to code or you know about robotics please jump on it you are going to be hot cake and they pay a lot companies like even amazon for example, when I was working at Amazon, I worked there for like, I think two years before I left. Robots were already doing the jobs of sorters and, you know, people that were packing. Robots were already doing the jobs. And that was like four years ago. So now imagine how crazy it would have been now. I've not even been there for a long time, but imagine how crazy it must have been now. So that's just to tell you how important this field is. That's why I put it as my number one. If you can learn any field that is AI related, or that has robotics please jump on it okay now the second one is renewable energy and sustainability this one is also a hot kick in germany right now because germany is trying to go green and germany is the one leading the green revolution there's even a proposal that says by 2030 germany is going completely green by 2030 and they're already investing billions into sustainability so that tells you everything you need to know about how important this field is. The schools now are creating a lot of courses around management and sustainability. They want to be the one championing and leading this in Europe and in the world. So if you can study any course that has to do with renewable energy or sustainability, please pick it. Trust me, it's hot kick. The only thing is that you might probably need German, but you'll be fine regardless just study it is a hot kick in germany trust me now the third course that i'm going to suggest to you is business administration and management but now the focus has to be on project management or digital marketing those are the two focus that i'm going to propose to you so if you can study any course around this you are going to be a hot kick the reason is because this is the world now of social media this is the world of online marketing online packaging branding so digital marketing is really really hot right now the only problem with this course is you have to be proficient in german and of course i'm not going to lie to you there are so many germans now that i know personally that are already 
moving into this field because they understand that companies now understand the importance of having an online presence imagine so many people are becoming influencers now that's the power of personal branding that tells you everything you need to know and companies now they are understanding that the world is moving now towards online branding you know so if you can tap into that if you can help companies if you have an experience with social media marketing social media management brand awareness all those kind of things if you have an experience in this customer service you are a hot kick but like i said you have to be proficient in german so if you can go through the stress of you know learning german first this course is hot kick trust me and you are going to make a lot of money ai cannot replace this one you always need human interaction when it comes to things like this this one i'm going to also advise focus on project management if you can add scrum to it if you can become a scrum master that's even perfect but project management anything that has to do with online awareness business management international business marketing all these kind of things is a hot kick that's my field so i know about it very very well that's why i'm telling you this so don't even sleep on it okay the next on my list is engineering now mechanical engineering chemical engineering automobile engineering of course you already know germany is known for quality their cars are one of the best and the most durable in the world your bmvs you know bmw volkswagen you know mercedes-benz all those cars are hot kick around the world and they're extremely durable so germany prides itself on quality so engineering is something that will never ever go out of vogue in germany you know and as we all know germany is the tech hub of europe so that tells you everything you need to know about this field anything that has to do with engineering don't even sleep on it and you don't really need german for this field to be honest all you need is the skill the know-how once you know how to put machines together to think about how to you know put this with this to with this you're gonna be fine it's always evergreen in germany to always be on everybody's list any field that has to do with engineering trust me and they pay a lot competition is i would say it's somewhat high to be honest in this field because there are so many germans who are studying this particular field and also they have the option of ausbildung which means you don't necessarily have to have a degree in this field like i said once you have the skill and technical know-how you are going to be fine so because of the option of ausbildung which is like vocational course or a vocational aptitude the competition is very very high in this field i'm not going to lie but still there's always demand for engineers, always, you know. And there are big, big companies like Bosch, BMW, Audi. They are always employing, always looking for people. So this is a field I'm going to recommend wherever you are coming from in the world. Once you have this knowledge, please apply. Anything engineering, you are fine. It's hot cake in Germany. Now, the next on my list is computer science and IT. Of course, this one, everybody knows about this. I don't really need to say too much about this. Anything that has to do with IT related, you know, as long as you can code or you can design website. Of course, now, why I put IT as one of the lists is because AI now is replacing so many IT related skills. Unless you are into you know, data analytics, that's why I put IT there because there are still relevant courses like data analytics, machine learning, all those kind of things. If you can code, yes, it's also really good, you know. So that's why AI is very important. Computer science is also important. Of course, you can do tech sales, tech assistance, all those kind of things. You can put instruments together. All these kind of things is really, very relevant in Germany. So computer science and IT is also a field I'm going to recommend to anyone that wants to do it. And the last on my list is health and medical sciences. Now, this one is also a hot cake in Germany because Germany has a very aging population. So they are looking for people, healthcare workers, they are looking for people that have, you know, medical line. But why I put this one as the last on my list is because while the demand for it is very, very high, you really, really, really need to be extremely proficient in German. You need to be able to speak at least almost mother tongue level, C2 most times because you are dealing with old people. And they don't know jack in other language apart from german so you have to be able to speak and communicate with them that's the only way they would even employ you in this field in the first place but most times most foreigners don't even get this job because even the elderly people they prefer to work with someone that they know that they can trust and most times i'm just being honest most times they prefer to work with germans or people that are, in a, that are non-foreigners than to work with foreigners is it good is it bad well it depends on how you see it that's just the honest truth and that's why i put this field as the last on my list yes the demand for it is high but the conditions to get into it is also extremely high for the medical sciences for example you need to be exceptionally good i think you need to have a 1.0 in all your degree to practice medicine in germany so the requirement is extremely extremely high 
So it's really, really difficult. But of course, it's one of the courses that is in demand. So I'm not going to tell you that because the barrier to entry is very high, you should stop or you should not consider it. No, I won't tell you that. I'm just letting you know that the barrier to entry in this particular course is or field is very, very high. So if you have a solid grasp of the language and you are a very, very smart student, of course, why not? By all means necessary, give it a shot. They pay a lot. The demand for medical practitioners, for people in medical line, healthcare workers is really, really high. If you have passion for taking care of elderly people or you have passion for things like this, then you should consider it. So my bonus tip for you, you will be start learning German easy. All these courses, of course, you will get by with most of them with English, but you give yourself the best shot possible by also learning German. I would advise, even though, yes, like I said, you have a shot with English, but try as much as possible to also learn German just for your own self, you know, and for your own self-development. It's paramount that you learn German. That will make your stay easy for you. The second point is don't ignore public universities. You know, they are way, way better than the private ones. I'm not going to lie, you know, and it's cheaper. So whenever you're applying, don't ignore public universities. The third bonus is think long term. You know, don't just follow the bandwagon. Be strategic about your cost. Is the cost relevant to the German market landscape? If the cost is not relevant, pick something else, okay? But if the cost is relevant, by all means, but think long term. Don't just think because you want to leave your country, you just come here and then you start struggling. No. Think about what will give you the best shot possible at where you are going because you don't know anyone there unless you have a family or friends or whatever here. But if that's not the case, then you have to be strategic about picking the courses that you know that is relevant. So do your research, watch as many YouTube videos as possible, subscribe to my channel, of course, because I'm going to be giving you a lot of tips. But, you know, ask as many questions as possible so that you have enough information before you embark on this journey. So if you made it to the end, then you are already 10 steps ahead of so many foreigners that want to come to Germany. And if you found this video interesting, don't forget to like this video. Also, subscribe to my channel. Let me know also what you think in the comments below. And if you want to know how to get a full-time job in Germany, click on this video right here. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out.